I was visiting a friend um, one time. I was going through something very, very painful and the person wanted me to sing. Now, if you're an artist, musician, painter, writer, you gotta be in the mood to do that, okay? If I'm not in the mood to do it, it's not gonna come out right. Now, we had been, you know, drinking a little bit. I mean, drinking as in smearing off drinking, nothing heavy. But I was like, I really don't want to do this, you know. And so, I mean, when it came my turn, I really wasn't into it. And I, I really didn't care, you know, about how I sounded. I didn't, I didn't try. So, of course, you know, I mean, to the person, I mean, I am a semi-professional singer. Um, definitely not professional. Um, semi-professional, yes. But I didn't sing on key. No, I, my mind was totally distracted, you know. Um... So later in the week, you know, I'd mentioned something about auditioning for The Voice, and I saw this look on my friend's face, like, yeah, right. And it's, I was like, you've seen me sing before, you know damn well, <laughs> you know. It was just funny. But the point is, um, the point as simple as this, with any art, you've got to feel what you're doing. And if you don't, it's going to come out shitty. And that particular night, I was not in a good place. Um, I was going through a lot of hard things. And the last thing on my mind was trying to focus to sing a song. And I should have said that. Then to, you know, make a fool of myself. But realistically, it didn't matter to me whether I made a fool of myself. Because, you know, I was company. And I said, eh, you know, I'll try. But your heart's got to be in what you do point being, you know, your heart has to be in what you're doing. Um, and that's it. If it's not, it's going to reflect. You know, so um, you can't take, you know, and say, well, this invalidates, you know, he's not a comedian, you know, because he didn't tell real good jokes, or she's not a, a singer because she sang off key and this and that, you know. Those things happen. Um, or, you know, he's not a good guitarist because of X, Y, and Z. You, no. You know, especially if you know somebody who has musical background and things like that. To me, it's just an indicator that the person's going through something very painful and is nowhere near focused enough to perform musically or writing in any way, you know. So it's really a matter of just respecting somebody for where they're at. And not necessarily thinking, you know, dismissing the person as being an artist or a technician or anything else. Because one has nothing to do with the other. And that is the truth.